This is a video to explain what a voucher is and how you'd go about purchasing one. If you or the organisation that you work for want to purchase qualifications or CPD events on behalf of somebody else, you can do this by purchasing a voucher. Vouchers purchase are redeemable events against any coaching qualification and CPD event that you can book through ULEARN. Before we show you the actual process of buying a voucher, there's some important information that you need to know before you book. Vouchers must be purchased from the organisation running the event against which you wish to redeem them. A voucher can be redeemed against any course or CPD event run by that organisation only, but only again for the monetary value stated. If the cost of the course or the event exceeds the value of the voucher, you will need to pay the excess. Similarly, vouchers can only be redeemed once. So if a voucher code has been entered and accepted as a payment, that voucher code will not be redeemable against any other purchase, regardless if there's any, ex any credit left on the voucher. So before you purchase the voucher, please make sure that you know the correct organisation running the event and you know the correct cost of the event. Once you're sure of those factors, I'm going to show you now how to purchase a voucher. So once you're logged into to ULEARN, which I am here, you simply click on the Vouchers tab. This takes you through to your voucher purchases page, which shows you any list of any vouchers that you've previously purchased. So in my case, there's six different ones here. Once you're sure you want to purchase, you simply click the Purchase Voucher button and that brings you through to this page. So there's a number of different options that you need to be aware of. Payment type. The quickest and easiest is credit and debit card. However, there are two other, invoice, other ways to pay, invoice or cheque. Please be aware that vouchers are only redeemable when payment is received. So if you choose invoice or cheque, that may be delayed. You then need to select which organisation you wish to purchase the voucher from. So in this case, I'm going to select England Athletics. You then need to select your voucher type. There are three options here, either your CPD event, your qualification, or if you aren't completely sure, you can select voucher and then you just buy a voucher with a specific value. I'm going to do that in this occasion and I'm going to select a voucher for £150 which then tells me that here and I can then click purchase. It shows me then my basket. I can either amend the basket if I wish to add another voucher or change the voucher I've already selected. If it's correct then I simply click checkout. It then shows me my details page so I need to check that all my details are correct before I continue. You then agree to the terms and conditions or if they're not correct you can edit your details here. Once you click the submit button it will take you through to our Sage Pay site where you can click your payment type, enter your details and then press proceed and that will complete the process and your voucher code will be emailed to you. If you want to see a list of the vouchers that you've previously bought simply click on your vouchers tab and that will bring up the list of every voucher that you've bought. If you want to see the actual specific voucher code then you simply need to click on details and that will bring up the code that you'll need to use. 